The photos above the case are of the Tennessee soldiers who served in Europe during World War II. The men were part of the 30th Division, Old Hickory. In the center is their flag. On it, you can see the letters O and H, as well as three X's representing the Roman numeral 30. The flag hung over the ship Queen Mary when she brought the soldiers home at the end of the war. Soldiers preparing for a mortar barrage are seen in the top left photo. A mortar is a gun shaped like a tube. The bullets look like little bombs. The mortars are fired in rapid succession to protect one's advancing or retreating troops. The move is also used to fight off the enemy. The top right picture is a soldier called a scout. His job was to go in front of the troops and report back what he was seeing. Once he had an idea of what the troops could expect, he then sent a message back to the commander using a variety of communication devices, including a portable radio, walkie-talkie, and field telephone. The center left picture shows members of the 30th Division getting much needed rest and relaxation. Most of their meals were from a can and served cold. On this night in a field kitchen, a rare treat, a hot meal, including gravy and cornbread. The center image on the right shows an assault on a home in Belgium by three soldiers from the 30th Division. One has a rifle, another has a handheld grenade launcher, and the third appears to be preparing to break the door with the butt of his weapon. The image on the lower right is of armored tanks with their driver standing outside. They're looking at an abandoned German vehicle that is blocking their advance. The bottom left photograph shows the capture of three German soldiers on a boat in the middle of a river. Members of the 30th Division found out their enemy had destroyed a dam, a move that caused major damage to American boats and their supplies.